Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. <laughs> we are here with another vlog, a kind of like a day in the life today. Um, I just wanted to come on here and basically show you what I get up to. Well, it's not really a normal day because at the moment I am staying home and currently dog sitting for my, I say dog sitting, he's literally my dog. So if you guys follow me on Instagram, you would have been aware that approximately probably about two days ago now i uh, announced on instagram that i'm now a dog mom so <laughs> went and purchased a baby cavapoo and honestly he is the sweetest little boy known to earth like i honestly i'm obsessed with him already and i've literally only just got him like i don't know but you know when you just feel like they say you feel that special kind of bond like with a dog that's yours it's just another level like i i honestly love him so much and he's such a good boy um yeah so this vlog you'll see him a lot more if you're interested um i'm going through the puppy stage right so there's obviously different stages to being a puppy teething is one of them and the teething process when i tell you that's been a challenge like that is actually been a challenge because for me i didn't think they they teethed obviously as bad as they do and they teeth really bad and they they constantly want to bite things so like he's constantly when you hold him sometimes he's trying to bite you depending on he's excited so yeah lots of chewing lots of teething uh grabbing things running away with things socks shoes everything um also it's been a difficult with puppy pad training he currently has just had a second vaccination so literally in a week he'll be able to go out for a walk so yeah i can't wait honestly i can't wait to come out i'm gonna take you guys with me in the journey because if you're looking to get a pet or you have your own animal then obviously you'll know if you know from experience if you had a puppy before it is not easy but they're a blessing and honestly i wouldn't change it for the world like getting up at 6 a.m if anything it just motivates me because it feels like i have a reason to get up you know um not that i did it before guys i did but he just motivates me even more like it's just another level so yeah i feel so extremely happy content right now and i just want to make some more content with you guys but obviously bentley's now in our life and bentley will be included in these vlogs so yeah if you're a dog lover like me you're in for a treat because i literally have been taking a million pictures a million videos of this little boy and i haven't just, i still haven't got enough you know i'm just gonna be one of those people that takes loads of pictures and loads of videos of their dog or like their your baby would have a baby i'll be worse oh my goodness for the first two nights i could not sleep right i actually couldn't sleep i just kept looking at him every hour every hour checking like is he all right is he because i was panicking in my head i was like this poor boy has been taken obviously from the breeders the place his mum and dad like the breeder that i got him from owned both the mum and the dad which i really liked because when i was looking for breeders this is another thing if you are looking to buy a puppy um just make sure you do your research and make sure you're buying from a, a trusty breeder um i purchased from a five-star breeder she was like highly qualified she had you know done all the vaccinations with him um and all of that the checkups he yeah and the, both the mom and dad were casey registered um puppies but well, they were puppies they're about three i think the mom was turning three years old so yeah facetime came over to the camera sat down and just looked at the camera like this i just thought you freaking cutie so I was like, yeah, that's it, we're having him. So yeah, I picked him up um, in Exa, which is where I'm from, which is even more bizarre because I was looking in London to purchase one, but then I found one in Exeter, so it was just like meant to be. Um, but yeah, he honestly, he's just a dream. So get ready for the Bentley content, get ready for the fitness workouts. It's been a mad journey, but get ready because you're coming in on the ride. Good morning, guys it is 6 a.m in the morning i've been up already about one o'clock this morning just to let benny out for a wee because i could hear him crying last night um and this is a this is a regular occurrence that he cries during the night because he's only a baby so i hear him and i think oh, i just can't let him like cry so i go and let him out for a wee and he did actually go um no he didn't actually during the night but he went for a wee this morning straight away two big weeks up oh, don't bite mommy Benny, he wants to play, so he, this is every morning, this is what we do. He's very, very energetic in the morning, it's like, obviously he slept, so like for him, he's like rearing to go, wanting to play. And for me, I'm still half asleep at 6am, I mean, I want to I wanna sleep. I play with him for probably around about an hour, um, well, maybe less than that, actually, about half an hour. Then I get him to settle um, for about half an hour, 
and then I put his food down. He has food, his first first amount of food at 7 a.m. Um, and then he has 11 a.m. and then 4 p.m. So he has like three set meals a day at the moment. Um, he's only having dry biscuits because of the fact that he's still a puppy. But his food will change soon because he's getting older. He is officially 12 weeks. Um, he turned 12 weeks old yesterday. So yeah, everything's, he's growing up. He's actually growing up. And I'm pretty sad by it, but I've had 6 a.m. wake ups, guys, since I got him pretty much. So, if anything, it's making me get up earlier. I did go to bed at 10 o'clock, usually, we go to bed at about 11. Um, so he hasn't even been sleeping not that long, but he's been sleeping a decent amount of sleep last night. So, here he is, aren't you? The man of the hour, handsome man. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. So, yeah. Welcome to a day in the life with a puppy. Here he is in his crate. He's got a really big crate. Um, we've also got a really nice personalized bed for him, but he did decide to go and wean it last night just because I think he, he actually is good as gold. Like he's only 11 weeks old and he holds his wee all night until the morning. Um, but this morning when I, he gets it's really excited when you say like morning to him. So he peed as he was coming out of his bed. So. Yeah, I'm not going to blame him again. I mean, he's got a puppy pads all over the floor at the moment. He is allowed on a, a walk next from next week. So everything's like really new to him. Um, but I can't wait just to get out and start walking him. I actually can't wait. It's going to be so good. But yeah, if there's any other dog um, or pet owners, comment below any sort of advice you've got for new owners. Um, my main, I think, focus is trying to get him to like have really good recall so i really want him to be able to like i say his name on a, on a walk and he'll come straight to me that is one thing i can't wait to just try and like practice straight away he already gives his paw he did it for the first time today i couldn't believe it i felt like i felt like literally crying and then he also sits down as well so every time he sit he'll always sit so he's learned those two he just needs to learn lie down and then he needs to learn to wait and stuff like that but he is ready, ready to do quite good for waiting so yeah i just feel like i'm blessed hello, hello my beautiful boys hello hello my beautiful boy <laughs> guys do anyone else just talk to their dog look at his little white patch does anyone else talk to their dog like a baby because he is my baby look at this little man He's so freaking cute. Yes, you are. You're so cute. <gasps> Good boy. Good boy, Benny. Oh, guys, he's learning. This is such a proud mom moment. Every time he lifts it off, I get so proud because he could not work this out to start with. But he's getting so clever and he fully is knowing how to lift them off now. Look at him. He's just so clever. Sit. Sit. Poor. Such a massive Poor. Good boy. Good boy. Apologies, apologies, apologies. I think I've lost track of the days. I think it's day three now. Recording this vlog. And this is the final day because I wanted to record a workout for you guys to put on here on this vlog. But if I'm honest, I ended up recording a reel. I just lost track of time. And I haven't managed to do a workout like landscape mode for YouTube. So bear with me on that one. I'm going to do so that as a separate video. But for my meet in Bentley vlog, here he is. Round two. There he is. Yeah, big stretch. He's just literally woke up, guys. A day in the life. I'm not really getting up to a lot just because obviously I'm a dog mum now. Here he is. And I haven't really got a lot of spare time at the moment. I'm gonna leave him on his own too long. He can't go out for a walk yet. So, yeah. I'm running out of battery. I just realised my battery's literally flashing at me. So, I'm gonna end the vlog here. And I'm gonna do a separate vlog um, to do a gym, to do like a home workout. Maybe if that's something you guys wanna see. Maybe a follow along home workout. So, thank you so much for watching as always. I'm glad you got the chance to meet Bedley briefly. And... Follow me, subscribe, like, comment, do whatever, and get ready to come along this journey of being a dog mom with me. I appreciate you guys as always, and I love you all. Take care, and I shall see you in the next vlog. Bye.